All right, so uh, welcome back to another video. So today, I am gonna be showing you how to fix AMD drivers crashing like all the time, like every single time you launch a game and play it for maybe, I don't know, five minutes or even a couple seconds and it crashes. Um, it was really annoying, I was having this issue and I tried something and it seemed to work. So. I don't know if this is going to fix it for everybody, um, but it fixed it for me, and I thought I'd share this because it's such an annoying issue, and it seems like everybody is having this, and AMD seriously needs to fix their drivers for the graphics cards. Their Ryzen CPUs are nice, but uh, it's no bueno for uh, the uh, graphics card drivers, so adrenaline drivers. Okay, so here we are on the AMD driver page and we are gonna find so Let's say let's see Actually, let's go So if you don't know we'll go to the AMD website. We'll go to drivers and support Well, so for me, I have the 6600 XT. So I'm gonna look for this and we'll go to there and you'll get an XT option. So yeah, you'll get the XT option. Um, sorry if you can hear my chair squeak in there. And work, work, please. Oh, submit, well, oh. all right. And then you're gonna pick your windows and then don't download any of these. Um, Download, let's see, download the pro software right here. This should show up blue right here. And uh, it's been updated, it's very stable so far. So far, fingers crossed. I have not crashed once at all. Um, and yeah, it's a very stable so far. And yeah, so. I really recommend it. I've already got it installed, so I'm not going to install it. But um, yeah, if you haven't already, please go and subscribe. If this helped you, make sure to go and subscribe. I'm trying to grow this channel to 100,000 subs, and I would really appreciate if you could subscribe. And I put a lot of work into these videos, and hopefully this helps people. So anyway, yeah, uh, I think that is all. I'm basically make sure you have whenever you're installing you make sure you have this installed and you make sure uh you could do even just drivers only but i've found that even with the software it works so like the whole package deal as long as you're on the 2021 version it works and uh, i've adjusted settings i've adjusted um the um what's that called it's the um, HDMI uh, override HDCP so you can uh, override it and it seems to work still so far do not update it will probably screw it up so uh, yeah anyway hopefully this helped you and uh, thanks for watching. Drop a like if it did. And make sure to subscribe. And we'll see you in the next one.